So this is the carpet we use. This is the stick that we use if things are too far back. And um, we have stickers for substitution, things that are fragile like eggs and stuff, and then putting heavy on the tote so people know that the tote is heavy. Um, and this is the extra stickers for our printers. And since I'm the first one here this morning, I'm about to go back to our little safe situation whatever you want to call it to get the printers and the handhelds for all of my teammates.
this. I had an item that's not on the floor. And I have to come to the back room and find it. And this is what our back room looks like. Alright you guys, so I'm on my lunch break right now. It is 11 o'clock and I usually have an hour lunch break. I try to record as much as possible. Um, but I don't like recording when people look at me. So I was kind of nervous. So if you didn't really understand it, if you have any more questions, leave it in the comments below. Also, I wanted to give you guys some tips on how to get your pick rate faster. Number one, I would say start off um, with a very easy commodity. So like... Your first time pick rate is extremely important and if if your first time pick rate is low then the rest of your pick rate is probably probably be low as well unless you work super super hard to get it up so an easy commodity to start off with would be chilled um frozen and let's see chilled frozen and ambient i don't really like ambient but a lot of people like ambient and they say it's quick so those three commodities will um, cause your pick rate to go up really quickly um, i wouldn't suggest general or produce first um, just because produce takes forever because you have to put all the fruits in a bag um, and then general takes forever because you have to walk around the whole store also another trick to getting your pick rate up is to stop your pick rate if you're having troubles finding something so in order to stop your pick walk in the middle of it um, I'll try to put, insert a picture here just so you guys can know what I'm talking about. But you'll press the little rectangular circle that they have, and then you'll swipe to the you'll swipe to the left, and then you'll see it go away. And once you click back into GIF, then it'll start from wherever you left off, and you're and you have time to find whatever item you're looking for without taking forever and causing your pick rate to go down. trying to see what other tips I have to get your pick rate up which is kind of like getting familiar with your with the store and a lot of people say this but it does help if you already know what you're doing instead of trying to like figure out what aisle you're supposed to be on if you have a idea or general idea where you're supposed to be or where the item is then you'll also go quicker like I said if you guys have any more questions let me know leave a comment below make sure you like and subscribe Thank you guys so much for watching, and if you like this video, let me know, and I'll do another one. And yeah, peace and love to you all. Sincerely, Larissa.
Let's go.